Make the first move. I mean, I thought she was way out of my league. She wasn't. Until he came along. Darling, you can't blame Adam. Why not? If it wasn't for him... No, 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 listen to me. Adam and Robin go way back. You knew that. I mean, I wouldn't compete with that kind of a history. She wasn't even interested in him. Well, obviously she was. <laughs> because he weaseled his little way in. Well, Adam didn't know what was going on between you two. The only person who is at fault here is Robin. She's a two-timer. And she's the worst kind of two-timer, because she went for brothers. I can honestly say I have never stooped that low. Bob, please. All I'm saying is, if it hadn't been him, it would have been somebody else. She obviously didn't care. So she's not worth worrying about. Not worth worrying about? How would you she's know? a dirty little two-timer. All right, yeah. Like you were with Sefton and Patty. Well, it's a bit different. Oh, what do you reckon? I was in love with Sefton. At least I thought I was. And Patty was a mistake. Exactly. Exactly what? <clears throat> Robin made a mistake with Adam. No, 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 that's not how... Where are you going? Going to see her. You can't. Watch me. Adam's round there. You can't drive. Marshall, don't you dare take my car. I'll walk. I had to do that. Oh, you were great. You don't have to be polite. Look, polite is at least you gave it a go. Polite is not Rachel. You blew me away, honestly. I did it. I actually auditioned. And you weren't bad either. Oh, I had stage fright like you wouldn't believe. I, I couldn't even breathe, let alone get up and sing. But then I came right. What happened? I don't know. It might have been a shot of whiskey I downed in the kitchen, but I don't know. <laughs> well, don't keep us in suspense. Um... Well, we'd like to thank everybody for auditioning, and uh, we'd like to say how impressed we were with the talent here tonight. <laughs> and uh, we can assure you that whoever turned up tonight will be involved, whether it's on stage, backstage, front of house, makeup, set building, whatever. But we will be posting a cast and crew list on the notice board tomorrow. Tomorrow. Oh, tomorrow. Oh, 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 these things take time. Uh, and can we please give a big hand to Dr. Hewitt? Oh. Uh, you're welcome. I actually enjoyed myself. <laughs> Good. Well, we'll send you out a rehearsal schedule as soon as we've got one. Well, I'm uh, quietly confident. As you should be. Thank you. You weren't so bad yourself. Mm -hmm. Pity about poor old Jack Hewitt. Mm -hmm. I can honestly say he's a worse singer than my brother Guy, who is truly atrocious. Oh, well, at least he gave it a go, eh? <laughs> oh, what about me? Can I give it a try? Victor. I would say as head of the community clinic, it is almost compulsory you give it a try. Matt Waverley, time for a late audition? Absolutely. <laughs> but what I find most unbelievable is the fact that you actually think, you actually imagine that I'm going to stay with you after all of this. The Adam, I mean, I... bad enough that you slept with my brother, my 17-year-old brother, my schoolboy brother. Well, do you have to but keep saying... But then you saying... had to go and lie about it, making him out to being some obsessed, love sick. He is obsessed! Well, of course he is! He had you! An older woman. He probably couldn't believe his luck. A schoolboy fantasy comes true. Adam, stop it. You're making it sound so sleazy. Newsflash, it is sleazy. Look, I've told you why I did it. I love you, Adam. I always have. Please. I don't care. I'm not going to tolerate you hurting me and my brother. Your behaviour is just disgusting. Oh, God, listen to you. What? You have to be... The most patronizing, self-righteous, arrogant... Well, what are you? Take a look at yourself, and what are you doing here? Robin, you made a mistake. I understand that. That's cool, but I'm not going to let you... Marshall! And Shut up. Look, you don't know what you're talking about. If you don't get outside now, I'm going to make sure you regret oh. it. <laughs> there you go again. You are not his damn father. See? See, look, I knew you'd see him for what he oh, really Oh, for is. God's sake, grow up. Both of you, you're laughable. What? 
Marshall, stop kidding yourself. I was using you, okay? Don't you think you've hurt him enough? I don't care if he is hurting. But I damn well hope you are, Adam. It's what you deserve.